what a time to be a Philly fan. The Phillies are trying to stay hot in the World Series, and the Eagles are still the NFL's last undefeated team. But let's start with our high school sports as the playoffs are just around the corner for our fall season. Some big football matchups this week with playoff implications. A big one between Red Lion and Woodbridge. That one is set for Friday at 7.30 p.m. And the winner to that one will punch their tickets to the playoffs in Class 2A. Some other big games on Friday include a Class 3A battle between Smyrna and Appaquinimic. Kickoff set for that one at 7 o'clock p.m. And then you can catch another Class 3 matchup as well, a big one, Middletown. They are traveling down to the castle to take on Sussex Central. Kickoff is set for 7 o'clock in that contest as well with two ranked teams going at it. In other Delaware high school news, we have another future D1 collegiate wrestler from right here in Delaware. DMA's Alyssa Mahan has committed to wrestle at Presbyterian. Mahan has had success throughout her career at Delaware Military Academy, and especially with all the work she has done in the offseason. Alyssa was ranked 19th in the Wynn High School Girls preseason wrestling rankings and owns a win over the 10th ranked wrestler. Congrats, Alyssa. Sticking with some more high school sports now, how about the Del Castle soccer program? Del Castle was able to win their first ever conference championship earlier this week with a 2-1 to one win over Appaquinimic. Del Castle sitting with an undefeated record of 14-0 and again are your Flight A conference champs for the first time in school history. Congrats to the Cougars. We've got some more high school stuff for you as well. The DIAA playoff volleyball bracket has been released. The volleyball playoffs here in Delaware, they got underway on Wednesday night as you take a look at the bracket on your screen. Smyrna, they grabbed the top seed in the tournament, while Delmarva Christian, St. Mark's, and Archmere grabbed the rest of the top four spots. The semifinals are set for November 10th at St. Mark's High School, and the championship will be at the Bob Carpenter Center on November 14th at 6.30 p.m. Well, Red October is carried right in November for the Fightin' Phils. The Phillies took game three of that World Series on Tuesday at home behind five home runs, but unfortunately dropped game four on Wednesday, and now the series is tied to a piece. A huge swing game tonight in South Philly as the Phils look to get back on track and take that decisive game five at CBP. A 3-2 lead would be huge to take back to Houston. Game five, first pitch set for 8.03 p.m. on Fox. And the Phillies aren't the only team from Philadelphia in action tonight. The Birds have made their way to Houston to put their unblemished record on the line versus the Texans in their first dose of Thursday night football on Amazon. The Eagles coming into the contest at 7-0, and they are heavy favorites over the 1-5-1 Texans. Maybe both Philly teams can take down Houston tonight. We will see. Kickoff is set for 8.15 p.m. on Amazon Prime. And lastly, everyone, do not forget the Hens are back home Saturday versus Monmouth at 1 o'clock at the Tub. And DSU, they're traveling down to SC State. Their kickoff's at 1.30. So a lot going on this weekend. We've got the Birds. We've got the Phillies, Delaware, Dell State. We've got a lot going on, but let's go Phillies.